a little update on Sexy Distributor Sex Fasciatum after he has done some work on this black Paco which has largely healed but you can still see the tatter in the fins I had to take it out of this tank and put it in the in the fifth or sixth tank in like a two month period here's a little horror not so little about 20 inches, maybe a little more so right now he's sharing a tank with a black, sh black shark and a uh, Proculotus lineatus a couple of placos and a gulper catfish my apprehension was about the black shark whether he would welcome sexy he did not welcome sexy he was trying to boss him around the first time, the first hour or so I put him in there. I was watching the whole thing. But then uh, Sexy got back to his senses and started to harass the black, pup, uh, the black shark. So after having pulled out maybe probably about five, six scales out of the black shark, black shark realized it uh, bit more than it could chew and now it uh, pretty much just runs away from uh, Sexy but Sexy doesn't uh, do too good of a job chasing it either so it's kind of a fragile or delicate balance I should say between these two that they struck Lineatus is too small and, and uh, agile for for sexy to really bother him. So he's, he's fine. Yeah, talk about problems of housing together aggressive fish. As I said, this tank is number six for sexy in like two months. Anywhere I put him, it causes problems. So this is the first uh, tank. It's been about probably two or three weeks that I haven't had a problem with sex in this tank. Distichotus sex fasciatum, Distichotus lusoso, they present a lot of problems in uh, cohabbing them with tank mates. Just beware. Thank you for watching guys.